All right, now we're back, and now we're doing Top Maniac's Daredevil Run. Yeah, so basically, Daredevil Runs, you basically can't get hit at all, which is, uh, which is basic. Yeah, the boss fight, but all you gotta do is just do the boss fight, that's it. You don't have to do an entire level, thank God. Well, at least for, well, at least not yet. Yeah, so Top Maniac is easy to take down, just be careful, because, because if you get hit, you basically have to do it all over again. Yeah, right here gets very intense, but not by much. There you go. I honestly think the Daredevil run was a lot pi more piss easier than the actual re uh, regular fight. But we get our prize right here. There we go. Easy as that. I'll see you in the next area. Alright, so we're basically just doing some, uh, some prankster comments right here, which is cool. We just showed off a Daredevil run, uh, a few seconds ago, and now we're gonna show off the Cosmic Mario races. Yeah, so this is basic, and this is a legitimate Cosmic, uh, Mario clone. It's not Bowser Jr. in disguise. Oh, that'd be some fucking shit if it was Bowser Jr. again. No, but this is a legitimate, sh uh, Shadow Mario, or Cosmic Mario, because we're in, you know, in Galaxy. Yeah, basically, this one is, is really easy. All I gotta do is do some speedrunning tricks like that, backflip spins, long jump, and that's it. This one's really tamed. I mean, there are some other cosmic uh, Mario races that do more, but not by much. Yeah. The good thing is that there's no, there's no uh, enemies to get in the way. Uh, that's the beauty about the cosmic Mario races, is there's no enemies to get in the way. It's just obstacles. You just gotta... You just gotta know what you're doing. It's basically mum uh muscle memory. They gotta memorize the level if you know what you're doing. Alright, later. Alright, now we're in a new galaxy, now we're in Beach Bowl Galaxy. Yeah, finally a nice change of scenery, which is always nice. And in typical fashion, we gotta collect five more star chips. Oh, just fucking great. Yeah, this concept is really, really getting fucking dr dreadful now. Oh well. Yeah, I'll speak, uh, speaking of, uh, of, uh, swimming, uh, Mario Galaxy has the best swimming, uh, swimming mechanics out of any, out of any Mario game, by the way. Mario Odyssey swimming controls were not that good, I'm not gonna lie, you know, they were not as fluid as in Mario Galaxy. And what I'm not showing off right here is, you could actually do, uh, you could actually, uh, spam your spin attack to get a faster burst of momentum. However, you do lose a lot of air on your meter, you know. So, I wouldn't recommend that unless you're a speedrunner, you know what you're fucking doing. Yeah. Speaking of the spin attack, I love the sound effect that uh, the spin attack uh, makes when you're sp spamming it underwater. It sounds so badass. You know, Nintendo, they always have the best sound effects in the franchise. That's why they're so hard to get on the internet. Alright, right here. Let's- we have musical notes. Alright. Obviously, it's playing the uh, Mario Mario Brother Lo Lost Levels uh, intro screen. Oh, that's cool. Get the fuck out of my way, Piranha Plant. Again, why the fuck are you in Smash? Why are you in Smash and meanwhile, other deserving characters aren't? Alright, so get that one up. Alright. And there's a Wiggler right there. Eh, let's just leave that Wiggler alone. He's minding his own business. Get a free one up. There we are. You really don't need this, uh, the switch right here. You can actually just get that, you can actually get to the start with a backflip spin. But I just ha wanted to show it off, just in case. And look at this star, it's not even heavily guarded. Yeah, normally the first star isn't really heavily guarded, it's normally the third one. Alright, I'll take it to go, fuck it. Alright, I'll see you in the next part.